What are you hiding? Leave it to me. The general has... Hmm? I think I grew taller. Present. Your command. Well, victory is deserved.
Come out, my son, and fight for me! Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved.
Well, victory is deserved. Come out, my son, and fight for me! Well, victory is deserved.
Abandoned shoes, scattered mats, toppled tents, and unfinished mushroom soup? Looks like they left in a hurry. They mentioned being initially permitted to enter the forest for a brief respite. However, they were suddenly expelled by armed guards in the middle of the night. Just look at the chaos left behind. I arrived when they were fleeing in disarray. There were hardly any young men capable of protecting them. I retired from the army long ago. I came to the Dark Forest looking for someone. No wonder. Those refugees don't look like they can afford to shell out money and hire a guard. You are such a nice guy. Well, I have my reasons. How am I supposed to find anyone if there's an exclusion edict? Helping the refugees just happened. The Thorn Guards used to be different. While they were conservative, many guards risked their lives when hyperfiends were rampant, safeguarding the peace of the forest. But now, with the corruption, disturbances in the forest, and Master Eomir's influence, they have become radical to such an extent. Hmm. Master, the title of a sage should be reserved for those who make wiser decisions. Despite being strict, Everyone respects Master Eomir, as he once led the guards at the forefront against the Hyperfiends. The teachings we received from childhood were that wind whisperers heed the forest's whispers. Dusk patrollers embrace its goodness, while thorn guards keep the peace. The three factions support and assist each other. As of now, yes. Let us go! We're only looking for healing. I don't know who you're looking for, but we didn't do anything. Leave us alone! Hey, did you hear people calling for help? Could it be that the Thorn Guards are evicting people again? Well, victory is deserved.
Hand over those people, Aaron. They must be the ones who kidnapped Damien. And you're protecting them. They need to be locked up. Lock them up. Lock them up. These refugees. They're the weak and elderly. Aaron, what are you doing here? Weren't you off on a world tour to sharpen your swordsmanship? Aaron came back a few days before you. He helped us remove the corrupted roots and tried to persuade the Thorn Guards to lift the exclusion edict. But it appears they won't heed anyone's words. My apologies. I am Aaron, a swordsman in training. In training? Oh, please, you haven't changed a bit. Your swordsmanship is second to none in the entire forest. <sighs> My old friend, your habit of exaggerating has not changed. Yes, Lawson, Lyca and I grew up together. They became apprentices of the two sages, and I left the forest to sharpen my skills. He's the one who's always muttering, this isn't the path I'm seeking, or my sword needs a clearer purpose. Then he ditched like in me and went off on his solo quest. Hold on, where are the refugees? Are they hurt? Take your time. I see. You were trying to get inside for medical help, but those cursed thorn guards wanted to arrest you. Yes! Oh, thank goodness you're humans. I didn't think anyone else had escaped their search. When those wilders came at night, we hid on a small islet across the river amid the chaos. Then one of the refugees started running a high fever. We had no choice, so we thought we'd sneak into the forest while those guys were on patrol. Then they came back and interrogated us about Damien's whereabouts, as if we had captured a wilder boy. Damien? Did you just say Damien? He's the reason why I came to the Dark Forest. Damien is missing. But I don't think the Lightbearer refugees are responsible. The Thorned Guards are too biased to be trusted. I've searched the area before and didn't find anything. How's it going outside the forest? Not a single trace either. Ah, you're right. Finding Damien is my personal task. These refugees can't be left alone. Rather than extending a helping hand, the Thorn Guards are forcing them to leave. Don't worry, Mr. Corin. Damien is our friend, and we will find him. Let the Dust Patrollers escort these refugees back to the campsite. With the patrollers by their side, the Thorn Guards shouldn't trouble them anymore. Chippy will take care of informing everyone. Chippy can run super fast. Thank you. This is a message leaf we use for communication. Please take it to Patrol Alina, and she will arrange everything. Don't you worry! Chippy the Acorn Knight will complete the mission! Thanks, you two. Where could Damien possibly be?
Vengeance for sale! Buy four- You're not even worth getting up for. You desire. Being a noble is always being on top. Both techniques and tactics. Hey, you all right? Be more careful. Be more merciful. Little at least. Power may make me more merciful. Little at least.
Come out, my son, and fight for me! Well, victory is deserved. Come out, my son, and fight for me! Well, victory is deserved.
Well, victory is deserved. Inventory, shipment, shield for us, for the light base. Well, victory is deserved.
Oh, so beautiful. Oh, good day, boss. Looking for me? No one's around. Miss Florida! Yeah. Miss Florida! Oh. Miss Florida! <laughs> hey, be good! Hey! <laughs> Miss Florida! Yeah. Oh! Good day, boy. Again. Well, let's begin our lesson. Don't hurry, your delivery's coming up. Ah, quick, more earth.
experience a bit of luck. The wind and frost unite as one. Every sword is a witness. were already approaching their limit. Making it this far has exceeded my expectations. Be proud of your work, young man. Corin's arms are, are pr prosthetics I made for him. It 
It's either life or death on the battlefield. I'm lucky enough to have lived. Losing my arms didn't prevent me from joining the army. After retiring, I encountered Damien, who was out collecting materials. Your vine arms are one of my greatest creations. The best, of course. Don't worry, Corrin. I will make you a new pair of arms when I find the right materials. Rosewood, yew wood, built-in gunpowder, switchblade, you name it, and I will make five pairs, no, ten pairs for you. Because you saved my life. I can't thank you enough. I'll find a way to repay you. Ah, are the Thorn Guards gone yet? I had the mechanical rover swerve onto another side road, making a noise to distract them. Why distract the Thorned Guards searching for you? For me? They looked really angry and scary. Even I could see trouble when it's running towards me like that. So I kept running, thinking no one would dare to come here. Then I got lost. Could it be? But that's impossible. The Thorned Guards have attacked and expelled the refugees. But Damien is a wilder. Unless... I don't want to admit that my fellow Wilders have fallen so far. But now, it seems to be so. Whatever the truth is, the Thorn Guards can exploit Damien's disappearance as an excuse to blame the Outsiders. Damien and Laika both live close to Lunador, which serves as the headquarters for the Dusk Patrollers. Most villagers there also advocate for open communication with Outsiders. If innocent children like Damien suffer such harm, it would be difficult for the Dusk Faction to uphold their belief. We all know Captain Carissa, leader of the Thorn Guards. She is an excellent mage, always meticulous and responsible. A decent person like her would not suddenly turn around and give such cruel orders. You mean, Carissa? Has she really changed? I haven't seen her in a long time since I've been busy investigating and cleansing the corruption. flower has a strange color. His magic is indeed outstanding, just as Lawson described. Just admit it, the mage I brought back is more powerful than any you've seen in your years of traveling. I've only been out in the world for a few years, so of course I haven't seen it all. How can I measure up to him? The magic he wields is indeed extraordinary. Allow me to interpret for him. What he meant was, oh wow, you're amazing. He's not good at giving compliments. You'll get used to him. <sighs> you're the talkative one. Shall we head to Lunador? We should introduce you to Granny Dani. She would be pleased to know someone is able to destroy the corrupted roots. With her on our side, Master Emir might lift the exclusion edict. Mr. Corrin can also have a good rest in the village. Will they... welcome me? Of course. Villagers of Lunadorf are very nice to outsiders. Plus, you are my rescuer. Perhaps I can even find materials over there to make your new arms. Everyone, follow me, please.
present. Your command? You're not even worth getting up. A bit of luck. Training to keep growing. Well, victory is deserved.
Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved.
You're not even worth getting up for. is deserved. Well, victory is deserved.
Victory is deserved. Come out, my sword, and fight for me! Well, victory is deserved.
for me. Well, victory is deserved. Come out, my servant, and fight for me! Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved.
Well, victory is deserved. Come out, my son, and fight for me! Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved. Well, victory is deserved.
victory is deserved. Come out, my son, and fight for me! Come out, my son, and fight for me! Kneel before the king!